I eventually want to own my own practice, so um, I wanted to be able to understand the business side of things and obviously getting an MHA would naturally lead to that and being able to understand and manage my own practice more efficiently. Um, for those who have the drive and the passion to do this, uh, y you can come out with both degrees and uh, your career will be positively affected by the extra work that you do. We're fortunate to have a wonderful relationship with Idaho State University. And we've created a process, a structure here, where our students can assume what we call advanced standing within these programs. So that if our ICOM students successfully finish the medical degree, they'll have many of these uh, courses in the MHA or the MPH program waived. And so they can get through these programs much more quickly. So I'm not decided yet on the specialty I want to practice, but I decided to do the MHA program because I know no matter what I go into, whether it be my own private practice, working in a large hospital, or even a small clinic, the information and the knowledge that I um, obtain from this program will help me in any setting that I work in in the future. So I am enrolled in the MHA program through Idaho State University, and I chose to do this so that I can better manage my private practice in the future. I'm an alum of ISU and I got a really high quality um, undergrad education there and so I knew that the graduate education would be phenomenal as well and I it was a no-brainer when they um, when you guys offered the um, option to do the MHA degree I just knew it would be a great opportunity for me since I already knew what ISU was about. We have all of our courses are online. Some you have to be online in class at a certain time with everyone else. And then some classes are asynchronous where you just do assignments as they come and exams as they come along. So it's really, uh, it's easy to balance. I'm on my rotations currently in hospital settings and in clinics, and I'm still able to attend classes, keep up on my homework, and, and just keep everything together. So. It's very doable. You know, the practice of medicine has gotten so much more complicated over the past uh, several decades. Uh, and it's no longer just one person treating one patient. Uh, we work in teams, we work in systems, uh, and we have to understand a broader range of, uh, of ideas, whether that comes through public health uh, or it comes through the business of medicine. Uh, both of those are really, really important. Um, and so this is a way that our medical students can get value added and really get to understand and learn a whole new area that will impact what they do in medicine throughout their career. And we're so pleased that our partners at Idaho State University has wor are working with us to be able to offer a combined DO MPH degree and a DO MHA degree. The nice thing about it is that you can um, take it at your own pace. You can schedule however many courses you want to take if you want to fill comfortable and you want to take two, three courses in addition to your, your DO coursework, then you can and you can handle that, you can do it. Or if you just want to do one class, you can do one class. We expect many of our young physicians will step into leadership roles. They may not assume so now, but they will. And it's important that they know something about the language of business, the language of the healthcare system. It's important that they understand something about leadership and governance, planning and marketing healthcare law and ethics, economics and policy, and budgeting and finance. This is the language of business, and many of them need to understand this to thrive and be successful in their leadership roles. I had no idea that this program was going to be available, and so I'm, I'm very grateful for ICOM um, because they're so willing to take on these bigger programs, even when we're such a new school, because they want the best opportunities for their students. So I'm very grateful to be here at ICOM and to be able to be part of such a great program, even when our school is so new.